Check this out, ladies and gentlemen of the internet. I have just gone and purchased this Hot Wheels Racing Alley six-lane racetrack for these school holidays. And if it looks half as good as what it does on the box, we're in for a boatload of fun. Six cars racing against each other with an electronic scoreboard, lights and sounds. And it is over eight feet long. What is that? Two and a half metres of racing circuit before a winner is definitively decided through the electronic scoring system. So we'll crack this box open now and we'll get straight into it and you can all check it out with us. Uh, just poke, see the arrow. need a few more vegetables. Okay, so the box is a little bit childproof, so I'm just gonna crack open an end of the box here, and we're gonna keep the box all in pristine shape. That way we can slot the set back in when it's not in use and keep it all unbroken and in tip-top shape for later. So we got some instructions there. They're always good and offered in many different languages. And yeah, we'll slot out the circuit here. First impressions, it's quite sturdy and solid. We've got some string that we're going to get some scissors to before we unfold it all, but so far so good. So here we have the track stands up in place. The track is starting to take shape. And as you can see, it's got quite a bit of rake downward slope to it, so the cars are gonna go quite fast, I imagine. And we'll connect this up and get back to you in a second. Due to the Homer Simpson style designed fantasy cars it comes with, we like the realistic cars, the cars that you can purchase in real life, or at least aspire to buy when you get older. So we have a 1970 Dodge Challenger RT 426 Hemi to unbox here as well. And we're going to test this brand new out of the package on the racetrack with some of our existing Hot Wheels to see which is faster. Take a look at that, all shiny and new, black, red shaker out the bonnet, looking a million dollars. And we're going to give it a spin. Cars are in place, let's check it out. Wait. Hot Wheels racers, hit your lane! We want to go through our entire Hot Wheels collection and see who is the fastest. Quite a bit of speed difference between various years, models, shapes and weights. We thought the heavier cars might have an advantage going downhill. It's not the case at all. In fact, they usually come last. The lighter cars also are not always the fastest. It's somewhere in the middle and it's something you can't really predict. We try to predict who's going to be the winner, but we just end up racing them instead and letting the track decide. These are some of our favourites, mostly sports cars, muscle cars. We have a purpose-built drag racing 55 Chevy on the end there. The gasser, that never wins. It's got quite a bit of weight on it. Solid steel bottom, but it looks a million dollars.
Wheels Racers, pick your lane! The sound is fantastic in person, it is quite loud, it's very audible, lights up, gives you the race winner, some engine sounds, some crowd reactions, and no matter how close the race is, the electronic scoreboard with these grey plastic flaps at the end here will always give you a winner. And we recommend having a smartphone on slow motion so you can see how tight some of these races are. We've had some incredibly tight races. And because it's so fast, it's over so quickly, it's good to watch a slow motion replay as your favourite cars hit this racetrack. And when the day is all done, this set packs up incredibly neatly, right the way down to some wheels at the bottom for easy manoeuvring and storage in your room and a handle at the top here, snapping quite tightly together, perfect. What a great set from Hot Wheels. Glorious. No, I won't give in.